Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Low Bricks. We are finally revisiting Jabba's Palace. And for this episode, we're actually going to have to peel back the layers of Jabba's Palace here. So we're going to be taking the actual palace section, and we're going down into here, the Rancor Pit. And the whole idea behind this episode is getting a back wall on this Rancor Pit, an actual rock face. And we don't have to do too good of a job because actually what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be looking up a mountain and then a path along through there but there are some challenges we're going to have to overcome like this which is kind of built in the set there we can't really have rounded corners we're going to have to sharpen that out a little bit add some uh, build up there that was a really bad shot but add some build up there and start building up this wall and I, I think it's going to come out and then come back in a little bit and then be level with this and then we're going to have to make a little bit of a transition in to the Jabba's Palace itself and do a little bit of a connection here because like I said, I could get this palace back on here properly. Like I said, we're gonna have a mountain with a path on the other side over here. So there's actually gonna be a path that walks up and a mountain very similar to over here, but right here. So it does overhang a little bit. So we're gonna have to make sure not to go above that overhang or else it's gonna be really hard to make the mountain. But anyway, Let's get into it, let's do it. Let's start building away and hopefully it goes well. All right, so what we're gonna actually start with over here in Jabba's Palace with this kind of building process is by of course taking Jabba's Palace off and taking a look over here in the corner. So we're actually going to need to be rounding this off, which is going to require the removal of this structure here and the extension of this out uh, just a little bit. So I'm actually going to extend it out to about there and I'm gonna do this in hyperlapse. So I'll see you guys in just a second. Alright, so now that we've got that done, as you can see, uh, it has extended out and around, we are going to want to start building up this rock vase. And this is probably all going to be done in hyperlapse, guys. I'm really sorry. There's not much I can do about it. But I'm going to start basically building up a rock face. And I know what you were thinking when you are watching that hyperlapse. You're like, Assistant, have you done gun lost your marbles? Why are you using colored bricks under there? And my answer to that is, there's going to be a rock face here. So basically, what we're going to be doing with this build up here is we're going to be building a rock face that goes up to this stud, not this tile, this stud. And that will become important later. And also what we're going to be doing and why I'm going to be filming from this direction is we got to build this corner here to round in to there eventually, but we're not going to be building that right now, but we got to get that corner in there, which is going to be the hardest part. But anyway, there's no point in talking about it. Let's just get right into it and start building this thing. Okay, so there you have it. It is done. And that was proven to be more difficult than it seems. I really wanted to not go too high up, but at the same time, I didn't want to go too far out. Or I wanted to go high up, but I didn't want to go too far out. So that was proven to be a challenge. But if you can picture it now, the Rancor Pit has now got a backing back there. So if we actually move Mr. Rancor there, I know he's quite hefty it's got a backing so that looks really cool although there is a piece out of place there so this is what it's going to look like and of course we're going to bring this forward so there's going to be a little bit more cave entrances and cave like things in the future hopefully we will get to that soon but this has been proving to be more difficult like putting this 
brain card back into place. A lot harder than I thought. The most challenging part, and I did know it was going to be the most challenging part, was that corner. And I discovered a technique that I think I'm going to use on the rest of the build, and that is this right here, where I can actually bring the piece in and then out. But anyway, why I didn't want to bring it above this bar right here is because when we actually put the Jabba's Palace back on top of the Rancor Pit, that's what we are trying to build here is Jabba's Palace, you can see that now it just barely comes in to contact with this right here. That is perfect stud to stud right there. So what I'm going to want to do is actually this is the stud path that the path is going to lead on to, and there's going to be a little bit of rock base. So this is the final height of the mountain right there, if you can picture it. And actually how we're going to have it is it's going to wrap down like this, and I, I think I'm going to have it wrap down through there and then come out right here so we don't interfere with this part of the mock. But right now it does look a little bit strange until we get that mountain built up. But anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this Jabba's Palace update. I really appreciate you guys watching. I know progress has been slow, but it's been difficult. We're going to continue chugging along. I'm really going to continue to try to work hard on this. But anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.